How's it going everybody? It's Richard with Home Tech Video here with a quick update video on Blue Iris. Uh, now I've stopped making videos currently because version 5 is right around the corner with a release date set in less than 15 days from now, which is going to be June the 1st. Now back on May the 6th, there was a version 5 preview, which was a four-page PDF outlining some of the really nice things that are going to be coming with Blue Iris soon. If you go on Blue Iris' website and click on uh, the link, I'll have a, a direct link to this, uh, you'll have a quick breakdown on what some of the neat things that are coming with version 5. I'm super excited about it. Now, a couple of things that uh, you know we can expect is going to be a new UI refresh. With the new UI refresh, this is also going to include updates to the web browser, UI3, and also to the Android and iOS apps. Now, I don't have any information on that yet, but I'm looking forward to seeing the changes and what's going to be released in with Blue Iris version 5. Now, I plan on doing a complete overhaul on all of my videos starting from the very beginning. Since everything is going to be looking a lot different, I'm going to start from the very basics to motion detection. I'm going to redo basically all of my videos with version 5. Uh, I hope you guys are looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to making the videos and um, I'm excited to see some of the changes that are going to be happening with uh, version 5. Now through the notes when reading through here, some of the, the changes that's really stood out to me is remote management which you're going to be able to apparently be able to access different Blue Iris systems so if you're you know system administrator and you have a couple of different things going on then you can basically access different our Blue Iris systems without having to use remote desktop which is kinda of cool and then there's gonna be a alert action set list so I'm not really too sure what this is gonna include but you know we'll find out and then one of the big changes that I've noticed with version 5 is that it is going to require at least Windows 8.1. I think most of you guys are not going to be using 8.1. You're going to be on Windows 10. So for those of you that are using Windows 7, it unfortunately it doesn't look like you're going to be able to use a version 5. So make sure you get your computers updated to uh, Windows, at least Windows 10, or at least Windows 8.1 to be able to use Blue Iris. But there's going to be a lot of new improvements with your CPU usage and how many cameras you're going to be able to run with your CPU. So basically it's going to be it, the software is going to be more efficient with the newer technologies that come with Windows 10 and uh, and Windows 8.1, whoever actually uses 8.1. But <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm, I'm excited to see what these changes are going to be in store for us too. So like I said, uh, I will be making new videos on everything with version uh, 5. Oh, and also one other thing too I'd like to mention is that there's uh, in version 4 there's already uh, Century Smart Alerts that's been added. I think it's kind of a okay feature uh, you have to pay a, a subscription for right now but there's other things that are going to be added into version 5 such as the ability for a LPR which is a license plate reader uh, I'm not too sure how that's going to work in if it's going to be saving the license plate plate to maybe files versus, uh, versus you have to go in and actually find the license plate in the video and uh, also facial recognition technology so that's very interesting. I'm I'm kind of you know eager to see both of these because I do have an LPR camera set up at my house, so this is going to give me a perfect opportunity to test these new things and uh, show you guys. So, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching these videos, and I uh, hope you guys are looking forward to the uh, new videos of version five uh, as much as I am going to enjoy making them. So again, thank you guys. Have a great day.